Well, I don't know how you call them, it kind of goes zoom 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 all around. People and digital scallery brothers and sisters. Hi, I am Sofia. I am a food blogger in Greek normally. I do videos in Greek. And after popular request, I decided I'm going to do one in English. Uh, I'm not going to do the Greek accent because invariably, whenever I try to do that, it actually comes out sounding like a Russian person trying to speak in English. So, this is my English, this is what it is. I should mention here that the popular request came from the Greek friends of the Greek blog, so this might actually be a very bad idea. But anyway, so I kind of thought what we should do for the first time, and we're going to do frappe. Now you know what frappe is, it's that weird cold coffee that the Greeks drink uh, whenever you're in holiday in Greece and you kind of see them nurturing that glass of coffee for about five hours, six hours, two days, you know, whatever. And you kind of don't know how to make it and you go and drink those frappuccinos and those horrible, horrible concoctions. So, I'm going to show you a um, kind of horrible concoction of my own, <laughs> which is the Greek frappe and exactly how to make it. So, let's get started. The right way to do frappe would be to have something like this. It's one of those, um, well, I don't know how you call them, they kind of go zoom 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 all around, zoom 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 all around, and they create that lovely fluff. But, I think um, it's not really probable that you would have one of these at your home, only the crazy Greeks do. See here? What would do the job actually nicely, and the Greeks will actually use this solution if this doesn't exist, where they are, is a jar. I'm sure you've got an empty jar somewhere, grab it, and we're ready to go. Now what you want to do, open the jar, this is the glass we will be using, so this is kind of double the normal um, ingredients. So we're going to get some instant coffee, we need two tablespoons of ash, one, two, and you're going to add sugar to taste. Now, you can do it with no sugar at all. I'll go for um, two teaspoons of sugar. Two, well, maybe a bit more. There we go. Now, add a little bit of cold water, just a tiny bit. There we go. This is how much. Close it really well. Now, after about 40 to 50 shakes, this is what you're left here. With, with, with. So, there we go. Open that. Empty the contents. Excellent. Add a few ice cubes. The more ice cubes, the better, obviously. And then, in the jar, put a little bit of water. Because you really don't want to waste all that lovely foam in there. It, it is coffee at the end of the day. You can see the colour. Just empty it. And again, until you can do <laughs> the right quantity. And you can even add milk to taste. You need a straw. And that's it. Greek frappe. So, this was the Greek frappe. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope I didn't sound too weird. <laughs> I hope you're actually going to make it and leave a comment underneath the video just so that I know that you enjoyed the video and you actually enjoyed the coffee. See you next time.